You can't even get the cab in the frame. All right, guys. Today's the day. Tombstone's chassis was delivered about an hour ago. This thing is awesome. It's big. We wanted to make sure to, well, let's just say we tried to make this as easy as possible on us. So, if you're ready, I'm gonna show it to you. It's good, it, it really is, it's good. It's real good. All right, you ready? Here we go. Bam! 2000 S650. This chassis really could not work out any better than what we have pre-planned for. Everything measures within inches of what that body is to what this chassis is set up to be. From the center of this wheel to the back of the cab is six foot. Tombstones center to the back of the cab is six foot. The factory frame that came on the 46 is 34 inches wide. On this 2000 S650, it's 34 inches wide. The truck was used for oil filled or something. It has these reels and everything on here. We'll get it in there. We'll get all that stuff cut off. We're gonna throw all that stuff away. We've decided to go with a 12 valve Cummins uh, 4R100 transmission. Uh, I have a billet 4R100 uh, converter. I've had it for years. It's brand new in the box. It's a th stage three billet, so what better time than use it than now? The truck is all hydraulic brakes, uh, so it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty simple, really. I mean, for what it is, the truck had a 24 valve Cummins in it. We're gonna go with a 12 valve, of course, make it a little bit easier on us. Still has the tanks on it, everything. So hopefully everything works out as good as we think it will. But the bed, of course, the bed, the wood's all broke out. We'll replace the wood. Uh, we're gonna build a headache rack. We're, my wife wants stacks on it. We're gonna do the whole nine yards on it We're debating on trying to make this bed tilt a little bit and Do some long ramps with a winch where we can winch cars on and off. The bed is only 13 foot long I would prefer it to be around 15 foot So once we get the body and stuff on here, we'll see if we can extend the bed forward any Or if we're gonna add some kind of dovetail or something to it. I personally I like the way the back of this thing looks has a little dent in it but other than that I, I really like it except for the real thing that's on there we'll get rid of that so with that being said we're gonna go ahead we're gonna get tombstone in the shop we gotta get uh, Pablo's Mach 1 off the lift but we're gonna get tombstone in there it's six bolts zip that body off get it off uh, set the body I have a cart set the body on a cart move it outside and then we're gonna take this inside get the plasma cutter cut the rack and all that stuff off of it and try setting the body on it see what it does so in this video that's what you're gonna see you're gonna see us getting the body set on here it's probably not gonna be permanent because we're gonna have to see if the body needs to be raised like a body lift to clear the engine and stuff on it but it shouldn't be a big deal as long as we get a good placement of it where it's gonna be we can go up it's, it's going up ain't a big deal we might go up anyways just to kind of make it more symmetrical with the bed so yeah this is it so get ready that's what we're gonna do all right guys a little update got tombstone in the shop uh, it wasn't the easiest thing to get it in here but we got it in here got the old four tractor back there it made it made pretty easy work of this so we got that, we get underneath there with the grinder, cut off wheel and saws on stuff. We'll get the body bolts and stuff cut out of it. Uh, get the column, gotta disconnect, or we gotta pull the transmission pan cover and all that stuff, get that out so the body can lift over the shifter. Uh, we're probably gonna leave the front clip on it. Actually, we're looking at it. We might be able to balance it out where we can leave the front clip and roll this out, roll the other chassis in, set it on. So, there we go. Okay. 
Oh. You can't even get the cab in the frame. All right, everybody, we got the new cab in the shop. We got the new. It was a pain in the ass, so we didn't uh, we didn't record. Can't forget the hood. So Chase just went to go get his wife, show her what the truck didn't look like. By no means are we done, we just put the cab on it, see what it looks like, set it outside to get the full effect. We think it looks badass, what do y'all think? Clayton, what do you think, Clayton? Dude, that thing is sweet. It's gonna be freaking awesome, it's huge. I just can't believe how well everything lined up on there. Exactly. Big girl. Yeah. Is that what you wanted? Yeah. Awesome. <laughs> That's crazy. Uh, have some to go back home. Yeah. And look, where the shocks are for the back road, look, it'll match up with the what was on the 46. <laughs> That's <very> ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, we rode it in there <laughs> and pushed it and pulled it. Ah, <laughs> wow. That's so cool, man. Wow. Can you show me that cool? All right, here it is. We got the body on Tombstone. I'm gonna be honest, truck's a little bit bigger than we kind of expected. It only took us like, I don't know, an hour to get the old chassis out, new one in, and it turned a big old fiasco. Uh, I guess when they moved the truck, they bent the steering arm, so it kind of wedged up. It didn't want to turn to the left. So uh, it definitely wouldn't have worked for NASCAR, but it worked for us. So here it is. Boom! Old tombstone. Look at that! Look at that! Oh man, yeah, 
I'll do the job. Of course, the cab, it still needs to go back a little bit. You can you can see the, the wheel ain't super centered up with it. But what's crazy, 2000, it's from a 46. Look how close that is. But once we get the cab moved back where it is, we need to tilt it down a little bit in the back as well. But yeah, there's Tombstone. We're gonna change the wheels, 22.5 Alcoas. So yeah. What do you think, Pablo? I think it's sweet. You look tired, man. A lot of work put in today. <laughs> Clayton, you look tired too. A little bit. A little bit, but it's fine. You know what's crazy? Two weeks ago, this thing had been sitting in the woods since 1985 in the same spot. Now, uh, some young kids got it and did that. So, it works though. It works. A little massaging. Still ain't got an engine yet. Hey, so if you got an engine, go ahead and hit us up. We need a 12 valve. Let us know what you got. There it is. Road trips. Oh yeah, we like road trips. Road trips are our thing. We ain't scared to travel. We've been to California, Nebraska. We've been all over. Just for cars. Alright, so with that being said, there's Tombstone. See you in the next one.